Seriously, how awesome are Doug and Allie reenacting their marriage proposal on Strub Snap Swaps? Next up is KP Kelly, and tomorrow, on KP Kelly's account, I'm going to do something that I've never done before. I'll see you there. What is up, Strub Nation? Strubbers. Strubbies. That does not sound right. Friends of Chris Strub, I'm KP Kelly, and you're stuck with me all day. If you're already missing Chris, don't worry. A lot of people go through Chris Strub withdrawal. But screenshot my next snap. You can hang out with him on my Snapchat today. I had a great idea for the Snapchat swap, but unexpectedly last night, my twin sister gave birth to a healthy baby girl. So plans have changed a little bit. I don't know what today's going to entail with the baby being born. i got a lot of family in town, but at some point I'll get out and show you a little bit of Ohio, and uh, maybe you'll get to see the newborn baby. A little bit about me before I leave you for a couple hours. I'm KP Kelly. I'm a branding consultant. I specialize in social media and Twitter, and I'm from Columbus, Ohio. Most people online just think of me as a guy who runs all the time, and when he's not running, just eats massive quantities of pizza. That's a fair assessment of me. I do run a lot. I'm training to run across the country. Uh, I'm going to do a marathon a day for 100 straight days. I'm going to help 100 charities along the way. I'm going to leave you all now for a couple of hours. Look forward to Snapchatting more with you later, and feel free to interact with me. You can ask me running questions, social media questions, hair loss questions, anything. Another thing I'm known for is my rants. Every once in a while I go on a long Snapchat rant. I'm going to go on a mini one right now that I know Chris will agree with. So right now I'm sitting in my car, but my car is turned off because you should never Snapchat or live stream while driving. I don't care what your setup is or if you're hands free, if you're live streaming or Snapchatting while driving, you're putting yourself and everybody else on the road at risk. It's also illegal in every U.S. state, either under a direct law or underneath another law. So you're breaking the law, and you're putting that out there for everybody to see. The worst is when people live stream other children in their car. To me, that's child endangerment, and you're also setting a terrible example for your children. Don't live stream while you drive. All right, that's the end of my rant. And if you don't agree with my rant, I think we can all at least agree on one thing. These are terrible sunglasses. So right now, I am working from a laundromat while I'm literally just watching clothes dry. Now I guess I should probably tell you a little bit about my home state of Ohio. It's a good idea, right? I am representing Ohio in this uh, Snapchat swap, so. So I could tell you all about Ohio. I could tell you how Ohio is the seventh largest state in the nation by population, and that Ohio has had eight U.S. presidents come from here. But really, there's only one thing you need to know about Ohio, and you need to know it if you come to visit Ohio, especially Columbus, where I'm from. So in Ohio, if somebody yells OH, you better yell IO. I think we're going to go out and put that to the test today. Let's see if it will work here. Right here at McDonald's and see if it works. OH! IO! There we go. Into the grocery store. Let's see if uh, anybody. We'll follow along with the OH here. OH! There we go. So the OH IO thing works, though I am 6'7, 250 pounds, so when I shove a camera in front of their face and yell OH, they're kind of compelled to answer. So today was supposed to be my day off. I did a 30 miler and a 24 miler this week, but Chris Strub just totally inspired me, so I'm out getting in 20 miles today. Chris went out and did 15 miles today. I am beyond impressed. That's awesome. And each mile he uh, did in honor of one of his top Snapchat followers. That's awesome. I'm a couple miles in. We're kind of running from the suburbs into downtown. And every mile today is for all of you, all of Chris's awesome followers. This is a trail I run along often. Goes alongside one river, crosses over another right here. My next stop will be the Mecca of Ohio. So here we are at the Mecca of Ohio, the shoe, Ohio Stadium, where the Ohio State Buckeyes play. So here's the deal. When I yell OH, 
wherever you are watching this, you better yell I.O. Here we go. O.H. I feel like some of you didn't do it. I mean it. Wherever you are right now, I'm going to say O.H. You better yell I.O. O.H. So some of you are asking about my run across the country and uh, how I run uh, 20, 30 miles a day. So I'll talk a little bit more about running. So I'm going to start December 3rd running from Los Angeles, California to Daytona Beach, Florida. A marathon a day for 100 days. And I'm going to help 100 charities along the way. And what I'm doing is really inspired by Chris helping all of these uh, nonprofits while I'm running across the country. It's very similar to his idea. So he's kind of my inspiration. When Chris was in Ohio, he helped out Reading for Literacy, which is uh, based out of Toledo, Ohio. It's a great charity that I hope you all can support. I highly recommend you go to Amazon.com and buy Chris Strubb's book. Uh, it's a great book, but also we really should be supporting great people who are doing great things like Chris. Now, my run across the country, there's a way that all of you can get involved and uh, be a part of it. So I'm asking people that want to get involved um, to do one of two things. I'll be running a marathon a day for 100 straight days starting December 3rd, and I'm looking for people that want to challenge themselves to run or walk a mile a day for those 100 days. In addition, I'm going to be uh, promoting a different charity each day, and I'm looking for people that uh, want to go ahead and just send out a tweet or a Snapchat about the charity of the day each day. So those are two ways that you can kind of join in with me, and uh, together we can go on this journey of running across the country and helping 100 charities. Right now my website just links back to my Twitter and Facebook. We're updating it now to include more information. But if you go to kpkelly.us in the next week or so, I'll have more information. So I stopped along my run to change my socks and shoes, which I do halfway through any uh, 20 to 30 miler. I carry this bag that has three liters of water and has all the supplies I need. I like that I snapped about reading for literacy and then I just typed always be prepare. Always be prepare. It's prepared. My bad. That is some high quality H2O. So as to how I can run so far so frequently, I just put one foot in front of the other and I just keep on going. That's it. So health wise, I have a couple of issues going on. Physically, I have three stress fractures in my foot. Things are never ideal. I'm not your typical runner. And it is not easy. The journey is often full of uh, challenges and pain. For me, just getting out and running sometimes is tough, but I just get out there and keep doing it. Getting a little deep here, but I think it's the same in life. You never want to give up, especially on yourself. And so I don't. I just keep going. I think the reality is that we're, we're all capable of far more than we give ourselves credit for. So my little piece of advice for you, just keep going. It's part of the reason Chris and I connect so well. You know, this trip across the country, 50 states, didn't go as planned. He had a lot of challenges. But he just kept going, and I admire that. All right, Strub Nation, i got to crank out these last five miles pretty quick before it gets dark on me. But I have Chris's account for the next couple of hours, so feel free to snap back at me. Evan and Kaylin. O-H. I Go Bucks! Go Bucks. That was my niece and nephew. They're huge Chris Strub fans, too. Strub Nation is strong everywhere. I've enjoyed hanging out with you guys. Have a good evening and a great weekend. Go Bucks! Go Bucks! All right, Strub Nation. Now I'm officially signing out. You guys have been awesome. Hopefully we can connect on my Snapchat or on Twitter.